two wins in a row, two home wins in a row, you're top of the group after two games. Can't get a lot better, can it? Yeah, pretty much. Uh, probably one of the bigger weekends in our club's history, to be totally honest. Uh, beaten two, I mean, great teams, great organizations. Um, you know, f Friday against uh, Mountfield was a, a huge win, obviously. Uh, I think it took a lot out of us. Loved the way the guys got back up for this game. I thought the first 40 minutes was phenomenal. I thought we even took it to them a little bit. Uh, probably could have buried a few more chances. Um, I think they upped their game in the third and, and came back and made it hard on us. I liked the way we hung in there. Obviously, uh, winning in the shootout was nice. Would have liked to get one more point, but uh, what a weekend. What a great time. We're just... You know, this is what, what what you're involved in hockey for. It's just a great group, hardworking group, um, and I'm I'm personally really really enjoying it right now. Uh, grass coach said that your physicality caused them problems. Was this something you looked at before the game? I mean, the way our team's built, we have to be physical. We have to be on the in on the four check. We have to have a cycle game. Um, and yeah, I think. You know, I think that was effective for us in the two games. I, I also think we skated really well. I think we kept up with these teams, which is something maybe the first season or even last year at times we, we didn't do as much. Um, and we're really playing together. The guys are buying in. Our most skilled players are playing like, uh, you know, role players defensively. And when you have five guys on the ice all looking the same defensively, I think it's a, a huge thing. And, and we have that right now. It was a great game to watch. What was it like to coach? <laughs> it was fun. It was intense, fast pace. Uh, it's been a long week of, of work and, and time put in, and I think even the guys were, you know, maybe not physically fatigued, a bit, physically fatigued a bit, but also mentally by the third there. I think it was just a lot of emotion, uh, and um, we're going to need to get some rest now. Going into next week, does the pressure change a little bit here? Because you, you're top, you're in the driving seat going into these two road games. No, I don't think so. I mean, we're just, we're riding the wave right now. We're having a blast, uh, you know. Supposedly, our league has no business, uh, you know, winning games. And I think between Belfast and us, we've proved a lot of people wrong. And I think it's a testament for our league about how much better it's gotten. Uh, does it add pressure? No. Uh, I think we put enough pressure on ourselves to, to go and win. I think the games are going to be, you know, much harder. I think on the, on the road, uh, we're going to need to be ready. Um, and we're going to need another good week of prep here. Going to need your fans as well, and they were great for you. Too. They're going to be coming. I know that we always travel in numbers. I thought they were fantastic tonight. Uh, basically a sold-out rink almost, and, I mean, they were loud and proud. Uh, it, w it was really fun to play in front of them or be a, be a part of the, the, the win uh, and the guys having fun in front of them. Thank you very much. Good Thanks luck. a lot.